Hi everyone, this is Killshot from 999 Gaming. I want to do a video for The Walking Dead Road to Survival, and this is Alexandria Act 2, stage number 5. I've gotten a lot of requests to sort of rush through this, and uh, we had it up a little bit early, but I had some uh, other gameplay that I had to get knocked out. So go ahead and set this up for you guys. Wave number 1, I'm using an all alert team, and I will tell you, I felt like I was at a disadvantage the whole time with this because there's blue like on every level. And it did not match up well for my team. Luckily, you know, I brought the uh, hollow point bullets. I brought 20 replenishment. I brought the nerve gas and also the berserk. And you guys know the team. It's, uh, you know, one Rick that does baby heals. Dale's my primary healer. Another Rick turned the tides. Rosita's my multi-shot. And then another Rick with uh, really the shield that he puts up. So you can see the two down at the bottom. Uh, they're red, but I went ahead and nerfed them early on. Uh, but the wave number one is probably the toughest wave. If you can get through this, you can build a little bit of momentum. But I would suggest bringing a rainbow team in here. Um, all red and the blue with Eric is not a good mix for what I ran into. So you may want to splash in a little bit of yellow, a little bit of green as well too. Probably yellow and green would have been much stronger against this team. So here's wave number two. I got three blue, two red up top. So the blue is the immediate threat to all of my alerts. So I'm going to go ahead and use nerve gas on the two at the bottom. And I'm going to try to get this guy in the middle down as quick as possible. And I'm not really worried about the other red too much. I can kind of live with whatever they do. So you see I was able to get down the blue in the middle. So now because I got the two guys down at the bottom, you know, they're not hitting as hard. I'm going to go ahead and take these two red down. I went ahead and used a berserk on them. And I made a couple of mistakes on this as far as targeting. So... I know you guys will see that and pick it out during the video, but um, did hold my own. You see this brutal blast hit pretty hard. So I'm going to go ahead and multi-shot here, try to get one of these blue down as quick as I possibly can. And because I got two of them up still and I had some extra supplies, I'm going to go ahead and use nerve gas on them again. I just don't want to you know, stress my healers out too much here, especially since I don't have an adrenaline rush up at the moment. And able to get through wave number two. So moving on to wave number three, I got Dale's adrenaline rush up. But here we go again. Two blue down at the bottom. We're going to nerf those. Um, and here's one of the mistakes I was talking about. I went ahead and lowered the defense on the guys up top. And I wasn't ready to hit them yet. But luckily, I did have Rosita's multi-shot up. So it didn't wasn't as bad as a move. as it, w it was a bad move, but it worked out to my advantage because the adrenaline rush did actually, the nerf helped that out. So I'm going to go ahead and take the guy down at the top here because he's still weakened with that berserk I put on him. And then the two guys down at the bottom, you can see, uh, this was huge. That uh, double brutal blast there took Dale out. And this is where I got a little bit worried. I'm in wave number three. I got my primary healer down against mostly blue the whole battle. So uh, it, it wasn't looking good. I'm just hoping I got enough supplies in order to, to compensate for Dale being down. And then, of course, of course, the worst possible scenario, wave number four, I got my healer down and I got four blue. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to nerf all four of those and then multi-shot and just really try to uh, to get as many crits as I possibly can. So I got this one in the middle. should be easy to take that down. And now I'm in pretty good shape. I'm back to five. We got five on two here. And we got the berserk still working there. So these guys are dropping a lot quicker than I thought they were going to. Still got pretty good rep uh, replenishment left and still got some pretty good supplies to get through this one and move into the next wave. But every time there's a brutal blast, I'm just, uh, I saw what happened to Dale, so I'm just worried. But I got Turn the Tides here, which is going to give me a nice uh, heal, nice buff. I'm going to go ahead and use Respected Resolve. So going into the fifth, no the fifth wave here, this I felt a little bit better about. At least it wasn't all blue, so we got all yellow. Um, pretty, pretty decent matchup. I mean, there's no advantage to yellow against my reds. But I am going to go ahead and use all the items that I have left and just berserk on everybody. Get this multi-shot. You can see I hit Jeremiah for 500, and it really barely did a dent in, in his uh, total health. But after about six other people hit him, then uh, we're able to take him down. So at this point, we got pretty good coverage all the way along the way. The only thing to help him is a big heal. So I just want to get these guys down as quick as possible before any wacky stuff happens. And there you can see there's one a patch up that uh, now i got to go back and redo all that damage again. So I want to get this uh, yellow up top down as quick as possible. I already spent two rounds hitting this guy, and I still can't get them down because they're, they're healing each other. A couple crits, though, that was nice. Now I'm feeling pretty good about it. I'm going to go ahead and replenish. 
and basically just got two yellows down at the bottom. And, you know, can I hit them before they heal themselves up? And that was huge there. So now that we got a five on one, it's all over. Just uh, going through the motions here. So that is Alexandra Act 2, stage number five. Thanks, everyone, for watching. I made it a little bit more difficult than I had to, but we did grind it out and get through it. So I would suggest do not bring the team I brought. Stay away from all red. Make it a rainbow team. Peace.